think more than any other industry, the, the film industry is one that's uh, based upon community uh, and collaboration. It's uh, you know the most collaborative medium that I've discovered. You know, I've been working in the arts for the last you know 25 years, uh, um, and films simply don't happen uh, you know without uh, without community. Labs like this for folks to interact and, and touch an eclectic group of people like are, are here at the uh, at the Stowe Lab. I think is really important to get perspectives. It's, you know, it's uh, it's a medium that's subjective by nature, and to have input from folks from, you know, very different, you know, walks of life, whether it be you know age or, um, you know, ethnicity or uh, gender or whatever, um, you know, to have different perspectives, you know, opine about your work, I think is is you know fundamental to the process. I think what what distinguishes uh, this lab, at least in my opinion, that, you know, is is the diversity of people that are here. You know, I've been in groups of folks from um, from New York and Los Angeles, of course, but also Texas and Alabama and uh, Australia and Belgium and Amsterdam. You know, all sitting at, a, at at you know one table. You know, sharing their opinions about each other's work, which. Um, it's pretty unique. I mean, with, with all the festivals I've been to, and I've had 25 years at Sundance and probably, you know, 10 at Toronto or like that, um, you know, when I've, you know, it, more often than not, it's L.A. and New York. Uh, and, uh, you know, despite the, uh, that, that uh, you know, sort of New Yorker uh, image of, of sort of New York and Los Angeles and, and all the flyover states, the, you know, the country and the world is a little bigger than New York and Los Angeles. So um, I found that in, in my couple of days here, um, the perspectives are very sort of, different than I'm accustomed to. It's not just East and West Coast. There's there's sort of a lot of opinions and perspectives that exist outside, you know, the, the, the East and West Coast of this country. And by the way, you know, we're in the middle of this beautiful sort of, I don't know what you can see, but, you know, um, we're in the mountains of, of Vermont. It's just such a different uh, setting than I'm accustomed to. I mean, at the Sundance Lab was kind of awesome being up in the, you know, in the mountains of, of Utah. Um, but somehow I just feel so blissed here. And it's... Uh, you know the defenses, uh, you know, are, are are down, and it's just much easier in certain regard to, you know, to communicate when, um, you know, all that's in the background are you know, birds flapping around, you know, and and uh, the air is clean. I don't I don't live on in space, but it, it does make a difference to be able to sleep at night and to be able to um, have these types of, of conversations, uh, you know, without the honks, the, excuse me, the honks in the in the background and the cars passing by and so on. It's just. Uh, Personally speaking, it lets me focus a lot more, just the setting itself.